Hey everybody, Rod here, and welcome back to Control. So, we last left off fighting against the mold hosts for our friend back underneath the central research. Uh, I forgot her name, I'm sorry, you'll have to forgive me. <laughs> uh, mm, I'm trying to think off the top of my head, but nothing. Maybe if I go to the uh, mission, it'll tell me. Dr. Underhill, Underhill, there we go. For some reason I was, <coughs> excuse me, I was thinking of something else. I was like under, under the spell, under, I don't know. Anyways, um, so we found one of them and there was a hell of enemies in here, but I think I know where one of them is going to be because uh, I loaded up the game and I looked over here and I was like, oh, I even thought to myself like, wait, I remember a couple episodes back, I always say a couple, I honestly have no idea how many it is, but I remember a while back probably 10 episodes ago, let's say. Um, I came down here and I was like, what the hell's the point of this? Well, I think now we're gonna find out. I think this was the point of this area. Oh, hi there. Oh, hi there. Where'd he go? Whew. Yeah, that's what I think the purpose was. Because I didn't really see anything else down here. <clears throat> Nothing worth of use, anyway. <coughs> Excuse me, I'm not sure what the hell is going on. Ugh. Go back up this lovely... Uh, why is her hair going up? Sorry, guys, don't mind me. Okay, um, I want to say... But the next one's gonna be like, uh, damn it, I knew it. I was wondering if the next one would be up here, possibly. Alright, let's see what we got. Nah, fam. I'm gonna need you to take that back. Nah, fam. I'm gonna need you to, I'm, hey, I'm gonna need you to take this one, too. I appreciate if you didn't. Where did that come from? Hey. I need to kill this thing first. Yeah, get wrecked. Switching guns. Whoa, hey there. Hi, friend. Yeah, that's right. Killed you with your friend. What's up? I really like the charge shot. <laughs> this one's cool. Fuck out of here. Oh, shit. I didn't realize. Oops. I thought I was using a different gun. Somebody else wants it. I know you're here. Where'd you go? Stupid item back. What the hell? There's still more? Not allowed. I won't have it. There's another one. Whoa. Holy shit. Are we done? Good lord. I don't remember all that. Okay, so... Uh, maybe up here? Yeah. Huh. I thought there'd be something up here. Nothing at all? Just plants? Aww. I thought for sure. I was like, yeah. There's going to be an item up here. Not even anything hidden in the plants. Well, that's kind of lame. Oh, well. Uh, see, it says Ritual Division. So... Uh, what is it? Up on the D-pad? How far can we go... Until it's like, hey, you're not in Ritual Division anymore. Because it doesn't seem like it's that big of an area. Oh my. So I feel like once we leave here... I'm trying to remember where the last one was at. Yeah, it says now we're in luck and probability. Okay. <clears throat> 
So the ritual division is specifically this room. We can't go over there. We went down the elevator. Uh, was one just like on the ground? Oh, I got an idea. I mean, I don't see anything, but it could be back here. This is the ritual division still. No. Hmm. Well, I didn't, uh... I didn't go up here. Aha! Yeah, here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh, okay, this is just where the elevator took us. Damn it. <laughs> I thought the elevator went down. I didn't realize it went up. I didn't even put two and two together that that was the same room. Uh. Well, where the hell would the last one be then? Because once you go, once you go through here, you're in protective studies. Yeah. Hmm. What am I missing, you guys? I feel like I'm having my stream all over again. I was just like, what am I missing? Because <clears throat> this is a different area, right? Okay. Is this where we fought the first one? It must be. Yeah, I think we fought him. He was up here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so... Unless there was another one hidden here somewhere, which there's not. The hell was that? And there's not another... Oh, wait, what's this? Oh yeah, the mirror tested. That's right, that's right, that's right. Okay, yeah, we did that. That's right, that's right. Sorry, I was having a brain fart. I'll probably end up cutting this out anyway. <laughs> Till I find the damn area we're looking for. Okay, so we can't get to central research from here. <clears throat> well, see, now that was a separate division, and we went through there, and we found it. But I assume it's all connected to this room. Because this... Ritual office goes up there. And then we got one there. And we can't go anywhere else up here, right? Like, there was no other room. And then once we go this way, I'm sure this is too... Oh, wait. Is this it? Aha! Yeah. I should let Andre. I was gonna say, I'm like, they usually try to keep it very close to one another. Um, Alright, well now we can go ahead and talk back, go back to Underhill. What the hell was that? We're under attack again? Nope. Nope. Not today. <laughs> I do love that you can do that, that's awesome. Uh, was she the active threshold? I've come back. I bring you gifts again, Dr. Underhill. Request lock for laboratory door. I found the host. They won't be spreading any more mold. Well done. I'll send burn teams to sanitize the locations. I'm beginning to wonder if these Please hosts are more. originating outside the threshold in independent patches of mold growth. You don't sound very optimistic. Optimism is for farmers, as my mother always said. I suppose you could now return to that hiss business you all seem so concerned about. This woman has some incredible tunnel vision. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Thanks for the information. My pleasure. Oh yeah. Wait, shouldn't we talk to her for um uh for Pope? 
Do you need something? Have you worked with Emily Pope? Our paths have crossed. Darling arranged for us to have a coffee. A meeting of the minds, he called it. She's talented. I can certainly see her doing well here. I feel like there's a but coming. <laughs> but she's drunk a bit too much of the Bureau's proverbial Kool-Aid. She shouldn't be afraid to forge ahead on her own. Science is skepticism. Everything must be questioned before the truth can emerge. <clears throat> okay. Thanks for the information. My pleasure. Yeah, whatever. She must work at Chick-fil-A or something. Alright, um... So with that being said, I believe... All that's left is to cleanse those. And then, yeah, I want to go to the medical wing and the containment sector because there's one more mission for Adi. I don't even know if there's more after that. Like, I don't know if we'll have more. We should go back and check, too. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> so you want to know how my wool research is getting on, Casper? Here it is. Microscopic organisms similar in appearance to blank construct the architecture of the mold. I do not understand these blank are uh, original disseminators of the mold or bitten by some fungal infection. The mold is so prolific and durable or is the most prolific and durable organism I have ever seen. I theorize that the mold source has located somewhere on our side of the threshold, rooted here uh, to accelerate the growth in our dimension. I refer to this yet unknown source as Mold 1. The mold produces an enticing aroma to encourage human consumption on itself. It propagates the chest cavity and quickly consumes or subsumes the entire body, seizing control of motor functions. Oh, jeez. That makes sense. This behavior was not observed when I first arrived, which means the mold has adapted to our presence, targeting our biological imperatives as a way to spread. It is truly ingenious little thing. A full report uh, will be ready soon. Keep your slacks on. Oh, well, that's it's supposed to be for Casper. Okay. Like, I, for some reason, I saw the name in the beginning, but I thought, I was just like, huh? What? I thought I saw another file over here, yeah. <clears throat> Let's see what you got. Hello, Rhea. How's it going down there? And who's this from, actually? Uh, from Darling. Ah, okay. So this is what we should have read first, technically. Uh, how's it going down there? Enjoying the mold so far? Uh, settling back at the life of the old FBC? I also wanted to ask um, how your coffee with Emily went. She's a star on the rise, incredibly bright, extremely intuitive. But I want to hear what you thought of her. I think you two could be very good on a project together, could learn a lot from each other. Let's get together and chat about it soon. Anyway, sorry for the interruption. I'm sure you can think of anything besides the mold right now. Can't think of anything. You always were a woman of focus. I always admired that about you. Talk soon, Casper. Yeah, so he must have sent that, and then that was her reply letter, which never made its way to him, and we also don't know where he is as well. Um, so let's go to the medical wing, then. I think this is the spot I was talking about that I was like, I know exactly where it's going to be located. <coughs> Excuse me. close. I like that you can throw the shield at him. I'm trying to get better at using the shield. But I remember being right here. So it's going to be back here, I assume. Or this is just items. Okay. Entropic Echo. And another one. Projectile speed, 30. And then... Shatter projectile, projectile spot. Alright, let me look at my mods real fast. <clears throat> oh, my PlayStation's really loud. I'm trying to sit further away, so hopefully it's not as loud on the... Uh, on the TV, or on the... Recording, I mean. Anything with like a 3, let's get rid of it. Should be enough. 
I wish you could have more weapon mods. Is that a thing we can upgrade? That's not something I've really looked into. <clears throat> or be able to carry them, I mean. I know you can upgrade your weapon. <coughs> Ooh. Excuse me. I know you can upgrade your weapon, and you can hold up to three mods, but I meant, like, can we carry more mods all day? Like, is that a thing? All right, um, so I thought for sure it was going to be there, but that was just kind of like a secret room, so let's keep going. We still don't know how to get that way either. Oh, yeah, we do. Got that level six now. So this is what I like. You go back and do missions, and you're like, hey, now I can get in this spot that I can... Ooh. Mark Gibson, male, age 28. Returned from the astral plane approximately 13 minutes ago. This was his 21st dive. Patient is experiencing migraine-like pain. There we go. I'm trying to find a spot so you can read the, the subtitles. Blindness. He has no recollection of his time in the astral plane and appears severely disoriented. Preliminary examination revealed no immediate cause, so we will be sending patient for... X-rays and... What the fuck is that thing? Oh no. So that was like the first case in the mold, maybe? Um... Wait, was there nowhere else we could go? <clears throat> oh, here we go. What's that? I swear there's a whole nother office. Personal mod, energy boost... Energy plus light. My personal mods are full too? Jeez, how's everything full? I feel like I barely pick up anything anymore. <laughs> I must just never pay attention. I have like all these level twos. <clears throat> Who needs any of that? Shield strength 54, 45. Fade energy minus 13. That's minus 18. I'll say, I don't think we're going to find anything better to launch energy cost we've got right now. I think it's like minus 21. Alright. Now we should be able to pick up more stuff. Open. <clears throat> Remote thought. Alright, well, that'll come in handy. Aha! So that's how you get there. All right. Um, well, when we first came here, there was already mold back it's here. It's gotten in here too. All right. Let's get cleaning. She said, cocking her gun. I don't know if I needed to shoot that or not. Oh yeah, I did. What's this way? It's cool that we can come back and explore these places now. That makes me happy. Because I remember thinking, like, when I first walked into one of these areas, I'm like, yo, what the hell am I supposed to do in here? I'm actually thinking of it right now. It's in the uh, Dead Letters area. I know exactly where it is. Oh, uh, what just happened? I don't even know what just happened. Anybody else want some of this? Well, apparently I'm destroying whatever it is. It looks like it's gone up. So I'm just gonna keep throwing shit right now. <laughs> I mean, was it all in here? Or was it just because... Well, no, the enemies weren't taken over. Those guys just spawned. Those were hiss. So I just shoot this thing out of here. is fucking ridiculous. <laughs> I 
I mean, there wouldn't be anything back there, would it? Oh my god, are you serious? Of course. <laughs> Damn it. Alright, well. Oopsies. Hold on. Drop the tablet. Whoa, what just happened? There we go. Uh, I got something. I got an achievement for something. Crisis solution something. I wonder if it's for doing a certain amount of side missions. Okay. I don't know why I didn't think to shoot back there. But anyways, that's done and out of the way. The only thing left, mission-wise, that we can do is possibly try to do the Langston's Runaways. We can give it a shot. Um... Because there's one in the Prime Candidate program, which we can reach now. And then the Research Protective Studies. Have we been there? Oh, don't spawn enemies, please. Ooh, we can level up, though. Yeah. Okay, energy. That's what I wanted. So then all that I've left is health and energy to be fully maxed. And then launch. Oh, that'll be great. It's looking good, you guys. I like it. I don't think we can upgrade anything either. Oh, we can. We can upgrade charge. Yeah. Cool. So we just need one more. Oh, if we would have got another remote thought while we were down there, we could have got one for grip. Ugh. That would have been nice, because I like this. This grip's probably one of my favorites. Uh, <laughs> okay, research. Where did it say it was? Protective studies. Uh, let's go to ritual division. It's right next to it. Say cleanse and contain the rubber duck. Isn't that it right there? But I don't know how to get in there. This is something we discussed a while back. Whoa. There's another room back there. Uh. I'll say it's not like we can get to it from one. Nope, that's sealed shut. That's sealed shut as well. Hmm. Well, the only thing that would make sense is you go through back here somewhere. Right? How do you even get back there? Because I thought this just, uh... Oh my god, really? Get out of the way. I thought this just went to one area, like with the treasure chest. Yeah, I didn't think this actually went. Hmm. Because this is just the HRA lab, right? Oh, how the hell? No. Wrong button. I'm never going to remember this right. Uh. Yeah, how do we get those tubes back behind there? So wait, was there something else back here? Oh shit! I didn't even see that. Oh no. I feel like we're gonna run into some mold boys back here. I'm ready for ya. Okay, maybe there's not mold? Is that just like there? That's the duck. That opens that. Oh no, I'm scared. What's gonna happen? Oh Jesus. Disappearing ducks. Great. This must be one of Langston's altered items. So do I, am I going off sound?
Where'd it go? I swear I hear it, but oh, there it is. Did it go back? Okay, what am I supposed to do with this thing? This is making me think of Mario 64 with the, uh... Cause I don't know what, how... Uh, the rabbit on Mario 64 when you have to grab it for the star. Cause I, if I can't get close to it... Oh, that was actually kind of close. Oh, that wasn't so bad. Finally, no more quacking. Huh. My buddy made it seem like that was really hard. I thought like you had to follow it a certain amount of times. I don't think me throwing anything at it did anything. <laughs> okay, um Seal Threshold Corridor. Where is that? Cause I remember what it is, but I can't remember where that area is. Containment. Oh yeah, that thing. Okay. Uh, hmm. I'll tell you what. Let's go ahead and do that um, at the beginning of the next episode. We'll go ahead and end this one here, you guys. Because it's only, I was only going to record for a couple more minutes anyways. But if we're going to have to go do a boss battle, I don't know if I'll be able to do it that quickly. It's been a minute since I gave it an attempt. But I do remember the process of getting there was kind of annoying. So I think what we'll do is um, we'll go ahead and give it a shot at the beginning of next episode. And then we'll get the last one, which is the mannequin. And I think while we're doing that, we can also progress story a little bit. And as far as I know, I think we should be good. Uh, I don't think I have any more side quests besides like just to doing the weapon things, you know, like uh, getting kills with certain enemies with certain weapons. Yeah, like kill his troopers in the maintenance sector, kill enemies in the executive sector with headshots, stuff like that. But yeah, we've done 21 missions already. Hell yeah, that's awesome. All right, guys, I think we're making pretty good progress. Like I said, I, I can't assume that there's gonna be a whole lot more left after we finish this next like main mission. I, I assume there's probably only a couple more left, but who knows, there may be a lot more left of the game. We'll see. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed, have an amazing day, and I'll see you guys in the next one.